Good What's up guys? It's me and Tanya. We're outside. We're about to walk Larry. Look anyway, guys. thanks for stopping by. Look what Tanya I found. found something. Found a nest. A cute little nest. Birds are so smart. Look how they use some cotton fill. Put it up in the tree. Hold on boy. All right, Larry's ready to go, guys. We usually take a walk about every other evening around our neighborhood, around the block. Because if we don't, Larry doesn't like to poop at his house. <laughs> yeah, Larry, for some reason, won't poop in our backyard. He will, but he hesitates. But as soon as we walk him, he poops right away. <laughs> Where are we going? Here's the silly one around the block. Around one block at least. <laughs> I don't know, it depends. Hey guys. How long Larry takes. Yeah. Hey guys, we haven't forgotten about um, you all and Rando Nautica. We, we've just been uh, going through some health issues, both me and Tanya, but we're working on them and we're not giving up on Rando Nautica yet. So we do plan to go out pretty soon. So just keep an eye out. Uh, we want to thank you for sticking with us and you know we appreciate your support. So, so thank you. and thanks for for those of you that watch my woodworking videos on the bunker woodworks channel i appreciate it i've been posting videos there about every two weeks i try to post every two weeks hopefully you've inspired someone to build something what's that hopefully johnny has inspired someone to build something even if it's a birdhouse gotta start yeah. somewhere yeah if, if you haven't tried woodworking you should try it it's an awesome hobby and you never know you might love it who knows for Easter we made some empty tombs that were I don't know were, were, were those on the bunker or no no we didn't show oh, those we made some empty tombs for Easter and sold a few it's Larry up to Larry, Larry. just He's just being the boss, walking where he wants, and his little dry fit tea. Oh, he hears people outside. We hope, uh, we hope that everyone, wherever you're living, things have been safe for you and going well. We've we have heard on on different news um, outlets. outlets that some of the sanctuary cities are really going through a lot and. It saddens us to hear that. Yeah, guys, I went to Mexico recently, a few days ago, and I recorded my visit over there. And there was uh, tons of migrants waiting to come into the U.S. And they have tents along the bridge, which is the border between the U.S. and Mexico. Uh, let me insert that clip right now so you can check it out. Hey guys, I'm on my way to Mexico. I just wanted to throw this into the vlog. I gotta get some medication that I need. But um, yeah, just wanted to take you on the trip with me. Check it out. I'm on the bridge right now, which crosses over the Rio Grande River into Mexico. Check it out. A lot of birds around here, a lot of bamboo. You can see um, U.S. Border Patrol on the other side. We got vehicles coming across back to the U.S. And we also have vehicles going to Mexico like that one right there. Puta. No, está bien. Fíjense pelado tan feo, ¿vale? <laughs>
U.S. on this side of the line. Guys on the other side, I'm not sure if you can see it well, but there are tons of migrants, people who are trying to cross into the U.S. I guess they process them one at a time. They got tents set up halfway down the bridge. I'll try to record it on my way back so you can see the amount of people that are waiting to get into the U.S. Got a lot of people begging under the bridge. You might be able to hear them in a bit. soldiers here at the Mexican checkpoint will not let me record so I'll see you on the other side no. all right guys we're in the this is the main street over here I'm headed to uh, Thank you. Very good, No, this. I'm going to a store to get some crackers that I like. I'll show you in a minute. So all types of stuff here, but I'm headed straight to the snacks aisle. Some medications here. These are all medications right here. Thank you. These are the crackers that I like. You can eat these with guacamole, cream cheese, salsa, pretty much anything, even peanut butter or Nutella. They're corn chips. They're like tortilla chips, but in a rectangular form. I'm taking two of these. But hey guys, 
I'll catch up with you again outside because I'm headed back right now. All right, guys, we're on the way back. These are all the people waiting to cross into the U.S. Mexico feeds them. I don't know how long they wait here, but there's tons of people. I've heard there's a lot of Russians here, some from South America, Bosnia. guys it's pretty windy but you all got to see all these people migrants getting ready to cross to the US and uh, there was tons of them I hope you can hear me with this wind but I'm headed home I'll catch up with you guys later peace <laughs> yeah guys that was my trip to Mexico it was pretty crazy of course I've been there a few times in this past month so I've I've seen it before hey Larry we're having trouble with Larry let me know in the comments below what you think about this migrant situation there's a lot going on in the country so we hope everybody is staying safe let us know if, if you live in one of those sanctuary cities we don't want to make this political. We just want to let you know what's been going on around here. And we want to know what's going on where you live. For those of you in, in Canada, we've also been following what's going on with your government. Um, and we look forward to hopefully some, some changes for you all for the better. Hey guys, we just ate a well you just me, ate. <laughs> I ate a triple meat water burger with some large fries and a jalapeno and so, I'm sure you all are not surprised by that <laughs> let me know how many of you all have tried water burger 
I don't know. I think it's only here in Texas, yeah. as far as I'm concerned. Maybe Arizona. There was another side state. I just yeah, I'm not too sure if it's Oklahoma if it also if they also have water burgers outside of Texas. But I know Texas for sure has them. Let me know if you've ever tried it. His little friend Oreo. Larry has a little look-alike, but instead of white, more white than. Black. Yeah. This guy's more black than white. Oreo black. lives in that blue house right there. Wait till you see the fence they had to build to keep this little guy in. Yeah, Oreo. We call him Oreo because he's black and white. And um, he used to come out and challenge Larry. He'd growl at Larry. <laughs> He'd come into the street and get close to Larry. But now they've built an eight foot fence. For a uh, tiny dog for a less than, like Larry less than 10 pound dog <laughs> yeah I don't we haven't seen him in a while so we're assuming he's fenced in now he used to be, used to be roaming the, the streets he'd even come to our our yard and pee in the yeah he'd, he'd pee in Larry's territory <laughs> there's kitties out there come on Larry there's a cactus there, you better get down. There's the fence. There's, there's the fence for Oreo. Eight, eight foot fence that they put up for Oreo. And next door is his little girlfriend's house. Remember the little... Somebody's having a party here. That's, that's where the girlfriend Oreo is. Oh from. yeah, there's another dog here where these people are at, guys. She, she would have murdered him. Oh, look, there's a friendly cat. Hello. There's a friendly cat. Oh, there he is. We have one cat that's not afraid of dogs. Kind of like Honey from the apartment. Come on. Yeah, guys, we're just enjoying the evening. Taking a walk. Come on. The, I think the temperature right now, I would say, is about, what, 82, 82 to 84 degrees right now. All right, guys, let me give you all our view for a while. We, the majority of our neighbors are a little older in age. Yeah, we, we like to look at the trees and the plants and the flowers around here. You can show them the tree that I hope to get a seed from. What is it called? An olive tree. Think. Yeah, a I think wild olive or Texas wild olive. there's a tree up ahead that has white flowers. With white flowers, we think it's called an olive tree. It's wild olive. Wild olive tree. We used to have one at our. We used to have one in our home that you know uh, maybe ten years ago, but we've been looking for one to plant in our in our backyard. Which is, yeah, you, you can tree. see it up, up here. It's got the white flowers. It makes a mess with the flowers, but... Yeah, it is kind of messy. But, that's it. Larry, did you say hi? Larry. He's too busy sniffing. That There's the tree we like, guys, with the white flowers. Of course, it may right there. differently. It looks like a completely different... It is messy. Yeah. It, this one, it's so pretty and it flowers all the time. Oh, there's another one over there. There's a baby one. We're not sure how many people are going to watch this vlog, but as long as one person watches it, we're happy. <laughs> right? Hi, yep. Hi, kitty kitty. But if you all want to see more Aww. vlogs, let us know. Our lives aren't very exciting, but you know. And I still have to do the cooking ones. I remember. I still have to do the Spanish rice and different ones I haven't forgotten. Yeah, we're not very exciting, but you know. I mean, we you might you might still want to see more vlogs from us, we and we'll do it if you want them. We have a lot of doctors visits you could attend. I've had a lot of oral surgery done. You could, if Johnny can go in with the camera on the next one, we'll record that. Yeah, I went to the Maybe dentist. Graphic. I also went to the dentist uh, a few this days ago Wednesday. on Thursday. Oh, yeah. I gotta go back again in two weeks but um yeah 
we've we've been busy with that guys but we haven't forgotten about you Never. you know how's the weather been for y'all we've we've our weather's been fluctuating i think when i talked to uncle rudy and the weather's acting up in the northern states where it's cooler or snowing we our temperatures drop from 90s into the 80s during the day and then our nights are our nights go into the low 50s but otherwise we started off with a a pretty hot spring which is is a scary thing because that means that summer is going to be unrelentless we've noticed that there's a lot of new subscribers to the curio show yeah. let us know in the comments if you're new and where you're from we'd love to know that there's Larry sniffing around yep he loves coming for a walk guys yeah we say the word walk or he sees my tennis come out yeah if he sees Tanya uh, grab her tennis shoes he gets super excited and as soon as we say the word walk so let's go for a walk look he starts him. jumping up and down like Wait, crazy and he's gonna look at you. go for a walk go for a walk, walk. Go for a walk. <laughs> and he knows he, he remembers I guess the apartments because he knows when to come up onto the sidewalks we usually go around one block sometimes we go around, go, two. Go around two blocks Oh, Tanya's mom is calling. We'll be right back, guys. Hey, guys, we're back from our walk with Larry. We're in our patio, in our backyard. Disregard the grass. I have to cut it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> but there's Larry over there. Over there somewhere. We're just enjoying the evening. Tanya wants to show you some of her uh, I'm succulent uh okay. what do you call it the leaves that uh, the birds keep knocking down so i take them and i'm i'm propagating them to try to keep making more little pups and i have one that was successful here and i got another pot of four others but i'm slowly trying to grow them out the birds like to come and 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 bathe in larry's little Water, water bowl. bowl so we're always having to change hey, that out Mary. hey Mary, what'd you do what's up boy did you say hi to the curio fam oh you got a spina come here come here you got what's a spina up, come Go here up, up up with dad good boy okay hold on wait wait a second okay he's excited he knows he's on camera guys <laughs> he's saying hi yeah we're just here guys we just wanted to record this short vlog i don't know how long it's going to be but we just wanted to check in with you all and let you know that we're doing okay and we haven't forgotten about you guys no we will never forget about you guys that's for sure all, all right, right guys, guys we're gonna end the vlog here yeah. let us know if you want more vlogs we'll try to make them more exciting more <laughs> more exciting than today's vlog yes. excuse me Missy hair day. Uh, this is what happens in the humidity. <laughs> this wild mess. Yeah, but say hi in the comment section. Also, new subscribers, let us know if you're new and, and where you're from. from. Yes. And once again, we hope and pray that everyone is doing well. We do miss you guys. And take care. Take care of yourselves and your families. With all that said, I want to thank you for watching. Y'all take it easy. And stay curious.